Oh guys, yo. All right guys, so because of the whole don't go outside thing, I had to come up with a few new hobbies, I wanna say. So today I'm gonna practice cooking. We're gonna be making grapes. Let's see how it goes. So first thing you need is a cup of flour. I already served this. I already washed my hands. And no, I didn't make a mess. So let's start. Next, we need two eggs, two large eggs. Then we need some melted butter. So I'll be right back. Now um, I'll be using Breakstone's whipped butter, not a sponsor. Uh, so we're just gonna take, I used the wrong spoon, don't do that. I'm just gonna take three teaspoons of melted butter. So One, two, I want to say two and a half. I'll just throw in a little extra just in case. And now we're going to go melt it. You'll see the microwave is back there. So we're just going to put the melted butter just going to get all that in there and then we need three-fourths of a cup of milk i like almond milk so that's what we're going to be using hopefully there's enough now you're going to see me measure this And of course, I don't have enough. So I'll be right back to see what I can improvise. Now I don't recommend doing this, but I'm gonna be using... I don't recommend it just cause it's high in calories, you know? I'm trying to wash your figure. What? Wash your figure. So we're gonna be going about three fourths of the way. about right. Gonna go ahead and pour. Now it says to post for a total of 10 times. Uh, I'm probably leaning in this part, so. Now we're gonna take our batter um, and place it in this and then put it in the fridge for an hour. So, Now I like to make sure we got everything, so we're gonna get a spoon, nice and clean. And I'm gonna just scoop everything up, you know, as you would. Cause why not? We don't want to 
waste any any batter, you know what I mean? Well, for me, it's going to be an hour. For you guys, it'll be a couple of seconds. So I'll be right back. And now, it's been an hour. We're going to start making our crepes. So, first, you want to heat your pan just a little bit. Then, you want to bring back out your butter, right? And, again, just a teaspoon of butter on a preheated pan. So, I'm just going to just a little bit of butter, right? Now, we're going to move the butter around, you know, make sure it gets everywhere. Our pan's heating up. We're gonna take just just an ounce. We're just gonna move this around. Make sure. Now, as you could probably tell from the video, I don't cook very often, right? But uh, yeah, I, I mean, I enjoy it. I think it's time well spent. Just making sure I have it about an ounce, right? You know, move it around. Make sure you got your spatula handy. So you wait 30 seconds. Later. Lo and behold, we have our first plate. Six months later. Now, this is my last mini one. Can you see it? Now, to the decoration we go. And now, for the fun part, we're going to decorate our crepes. Now, this is a mini crepe. Don't make fun of me. I just, just want to practice. So, we're going to take a little bit of dulce de leche. I love this stuff. Um, place it on the crepe, right? Ignore all this. You can't really see it anyway. All right. Then we're gonna fold it in half. All right. And then again. Now isn't that adorable? Look at that! Look at that! It's so cute! All right. Well, I'm gonna try it on a bigger one. Damn it, fold you stupid thing. Okay, well, it looked cute for the picture. I mean, the video. So, I'm not dealing with it. Next one. A knife would probably work better with this. Easier spread, you know? Yes, there we go. We like that. I don't know why I'm hyping myself up. I already made them. Now, I haven't tried them. I want to try them with all their glory, you know? I'm hoping they're good. I mean, I wasted like two and a half hours on this. Okay, well, obviously, it didn't just like. You guys have been here most of the way, but. Leave me alone. Now I don't know if I want my fruit on top or inside. 
Now there we go. Still kind of tiny, but I guess the pancake ones are a little bit bigger. I'll come back with the final product. Well, this was definitely a learning experience. I definitely struggled, but I did it. I am no cook by any means, so obviously I made many, many mistakes. Number one, I could have used vanilla in the batter. I read online it was going to make it taste better. I didn't. Try it. Secondly, I overcooked many of them. Yeah, high heat is not the way to go. Definitely go medium heat. But again, I'm no cook. But in an overall sense, I think they came out pretty nice. Take a look. Madre, ¿qué tal están? Riquísimo. Primera vez tanto. Estoy todo